Hi everyone, um, I'm Ann here from Ann Makes. Welcome to this channel. If you are new here and you'd like to subscribe, I would love for you to do that. So just click that subscribe button below. And today I have probably the smallest Dollar Tree haul I have ever done in the hist my history of doing these Dollar Tree haul videos here on YouTube. Uh, I know it's a shocker, but I went out because I wanted to get more of these. I had gone out to another store the next uh, and that video isn't uploaded yet but it will be uploaded. Two days ago I went to a different Dollar Tree thinking they'll have some but they didn't. They didn't have a single one of these. So yesterday <laughs> I yesterday morning I went out just so I can get more of these from the first store that I had seen them at they had them I bought 12 I compared the price of this with the length of what's on here with a lot of other uh, tape runners out there and for me this is really the best value for my dollar so uh, that's why I stocked up I also purchased four more of these white uh, ornament marker, ornament ball marker pens. Basically, they're like a permanent ink. So I tried these. They do uh, a very good job of writing on glass and plastic. However, the glass I wrote on was not absolutely clean so I do recommend that if you're going to write on glass that you do wipe the surface first clean with some uh, perhaps some rubbing alcohol and I I waited a couple days and the white did come off if I I dampened my thumb and I rubbed it really hard on the white so it's it's permanent but on glass it it's um, it could rub off so just a heads up about that and but on the plastic it hasn't budged it hasn't moved at all so I'm very pleased and it still looks great on cardstock so uh, I do recommend these if you're in if you're in like me and you like white ink markers these are a good buy at uh, your Dollar Tree so uh, since it was the same Dollar Tree I went to you think oh there's nothing new but there was there was one new thing they had these cute little embroidery kits and uh, not embroidery I'm sorry cross stitch kits and I like to do these while I am um, watching TV or my husband is watching like hockey on TV or something and I I pay attention to when they score <laughs> which either, that's about all I pay attention to um, and uh, I just liked having little projects and so I picked up a couple of these because I know many cat lovers and I just thought they'd make a cute little gift and they it could be a cute little ornament in your Christmas tree. So, and these are a fast cross stitch to do. So that's why I like these. So I got, I got two of these. It's little kitty, of course. They also had a, a puppy one and a butterfly and a flower. So I got that. I picked up a tube of this fix all adhesive cement glue. And you know what? Uh, it does a pretty good job. It, it Just be careful that you don't make the hole too big because I have a tube of this already. I used it because I was making um, a, a piece of jewelry, actually, and that was for Halloween. So the Halloween piece of jewelry, and that's on my blog at makes.blogspot.com. Um, it's a necklace that I made. I needed a little bit of, of glue to hold the... Mm, I can't remember the proper name of it, but the little ring that is on the bezel part of the pendant. Yeah, the, anyway, that. So, uh, and I didn't have any E6000 on hand. Uh, so I had this in my toolkit, so I, I used it, and it, it did a great job. Uh, it worked, except I did squeeze the tube a little too hard and I had a big mess on my desk. So uh, just a heads up, don't squeeze too hard. It comes out pretty quick. But uh, I thought it worked, so I got myself another tube for some other projects. I also purchased uh, a couple more packages of the Jot Adhesive Label Holders. I am just getting myself ready to reorganize 
to move and reorganize my room, which was, it's still a couple months away, but I'd rather have these now instead of wait till I have my room is complete and then I'm down to organizing and I go to this dollar store and they don't have any more because that's probably what will happen. I also purchased this little oval shape. Sorry about the, uh, the, the glare there this oval shaped silver tray. I have a little Christmas DIY idea for this. So I'm, it's in my head. I, it looks great in my head, but uh, I'll, I'll see if it works. But that what that's the intention behind that. And of course, I picked up a storage box. I always pick up storage boxes and I got myself a bounty bar, my treat for watching uh, movies this weekend. And that's it. That's it. I told you, it's the shortest Dollar Tree haul I've probably ever done so far. <laughs> and it's Friday. Yay! I'm looking forward to sleeping in tomorrow. I'm looking forward to not to have to drive anyone anywhere because that's my husband's job tomorrow. He is the driver tomorrow. Yay! <laughs> I had a lot of driving to do this week. So, uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, enjoy the weekend, people. I, I hope I get this video uploaded before the weekend. I probably won't. My internet is just, like, really crappy lately. Really, really, really bad. So, uh, thank you so much for watching. Please give me a thumbs up, like, comment, and share. Uh, follow me at anmakestyleblogspot.com. You follow me at Google+. Plus. Those... Uh, increasing my numbers would really help and uh, thank you so much again take care of yourself and I'll see you later bye